So now let's talk about the prosthetic torque wrench. This is the prosthetic torque wrench that comes with the starter pack. So this is a single setting torque wrench. So that means this has 30 newton centimeters. It's already calibrated at 30 newton centimeters. So uh, you don't have to mess with the torque or anything like that. You don't have to mess with it. It will automatically take the screw to 30 newton centimeters only. So this is really straightforward to use, but anyway, I'm gonna go over some of the specifics. So on one side, you see here's where you attach the uh, the bit to. So this side is, you can't really tell right here, but it's square. This side is a circle, but you wanna use this side that's a square. And this will receive one of these bits uh, only if the bit is square as well, right? So this is a square bit and it will pop right in there, okay? So that pops right in there. And when you're applying the final torque on your abutment, right? So if you have an abutment that you wanna use, what you do is you put it right in here and then you get it to engage. So you see there's an arrow right there. That arrow is pointing this way, right? So you know which way to turn it. So uh, you turn it that way and it breaks, right? It gives, it like kinks right there at 30 newton centimeters. So at 30, it tells you to stop uh, so that way you don't over torque it. You actually can't over torque it here. And then you know that your prosthetic abutment is already torqued to the level it needs to be. So then you just pull this off, this comes off together, or sometimes because it's two pieces, sometimes it, it might um, come off like that, and then you just pull it off. Okay, no problem. Just a minor little detail that might save you some frustration. If you attach these two first, and then you go for it and try to put it in there, um, sometimes it's a little hard to find the right engagement. So another thing that you can do is just take this thing by itself, use your thumb and your index finger to find it, to find the engagement, because you'll find it rather quickly that way. So it's really easy to find the engagement that way. And then you go in and you put your torque wrench on it and apply the torque, right? So that just makes it just a little bit easier to use. You can use this with the long one, right? This is the long one. You can also use it with the short one. You can use it with anything that has a square bit on it. And lastly, don't confuse this with the surgical torque wrench. So this one has a torque setting at 30 newton centimeters. The surgical one that comes in your surgical kit actually does not have a torque setting. So this can actually torque to infinity, right? So this one will over torque your abutment. This one will not. This one says 30 newton centimeters. This is the prosthetic wrench. That's about it though. This is the single setting torque wrench. Remember, it's square right here. It takes a square bit. Um, you you go the way that the arrow indicates and the setting is written right here, 30 newton centimeters. Cool.